Welcome back, everyone, to another exciting episode of Two Can Plays, and I have got some breaking news. It was actually just announced today, April 1st, 2023, by THQ Nordic, the publishers of Steel Titans, that they have renewed their contract with Feld Entertainment, owners of Monster Jam, and they will be once again working with the developers Rainbow Studios to produce three more Monster Jam titles, starting with the third installment of the Steel Titan series, and two more yet unannounced titles aimed for younger audiences. We've listened to your feedback, and it has come through loud and clear. You want to see more trucks in Steel Titans. Mike Hodges, CEO of the Rainbow Studios, said, A partial list of the trucks scheduled to be released in Steel Titans 3 has actually been released with this announcement. Along with the Feld-owned trucks found in previous Steel Titans games like Gravedigger, Max D, El Toro Loco, Monster Mutt, and Zombie, fans should also expect to find a lot more of the popular independent trucks like Lucas Oil Stabilizer, Axe, Bad Company, and Black Pearl. We know that retro trucks are really popular right now, so we've tried to incorporate as many obscure trucks in there as we could, Hodges said noting that many of the popular retro Spin Master toys are also making their way to the Steel Titans 3 roster. Trucks like Excalibur, Boogie Van, and Thunderbus are also scheduled to make their video game debut. We've also added more ways to customize your truck, both cosmetically and in ways that impact the way you race your truck. Still images of a monster truck garage with apparent parts customization options were released. However, details are somewhat sketchy at the moment as to just how impactful these customizations will be. Still, it's fun to speculate the possibilities for customizing your truck for races. We're really excited to announce a partnership with Monster Truck Wars and bringing their brand of trucks back under a Monster Jam title, Hodges said. Indeed, screenshots were released of Outlaw, Sheriff, and Carolina Crusher racing alongside Gravedigger. They both confused and excited us here at Toucan Place. And what about the other two unannounced titles? We know that kids are the heart and soul of Monster Jam and the Steel Titan series. It was simply too hard for most of them. We wanted to make an adventure game with talking monster trucks where kids could play with their favorite trucks right out of the gate and go on adventures looking for missing parts, solving mysteries and being taught life lessons, good morals, and maybe pick up some math and reading skills along the way. I asked Mr. Hodges how he felt this type of game would go over with the fans, and he replied, Well, the parents that we talk to are really excited about the idea of monster trucks being a positive influence in their kids' lives and teaching them something instead of just being mindless entertainment. When asked about a possible release date for Steel Titans 3, Hodges said, Well, we're considering a summer release, possibly June 31st. We want to do this right, though, so if we have to, we'll push development all the way to the end of first quarter 2024. No later than the 29th of February, though. All right, well, good luck to Rainbow Studios. Happy April Fools, and we'll see you guys on the flip side. Later! <laughs> Thank you.